I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a community helper who is a fireman. I take one finger in the center underneath and I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a curve line down on the left, come back to the dot, curve line down on the right. I come back to the left and I draw a curve line down, up, connect, and I'm going to draw it again. Curve line down, up, connect. Inside this space, I just draw a little curved line, straight diagonal down, straight diagonal up, connect. I come on the left hand side and I'm going to draw one, two little skinny lines, straight lines, one, two little skinny lines on the right. I come back to the left and I draw a curved line out, up, and leave it floating. Come on the right, curved line out, up and leave it floating. Now I come back to the left and I'm just going to draw a curve line up, over, and connect. On the left I'm going to draw some wavy lines, I should say curve lines, and then a curve line out on the left and a curve line out on the right. Come down to the bottom, straight line, straight line, slightly curved line. Now I can add some more curved lines at the bottom. Inside I draw one dot, two dots, curve line, big curve line, little curve line on the right, little curve line on the left, and I'm going to give him a mustache so I'm going to put some little straight lines. I come over here on the left and I draw a big curve line out, in, and up. I come on the right hand side and draw a big curve line out, in, connect. Come back to the left. I'm going to draw a straight line, straight line, straight line up, connect. Come back down here, straight line, straight line up, connect. Right from that point on the left, I draw one, two, three straight lines, connect. One, two, three straight lines connect on the right. Come back to the left and draw a slightly curved line up, over, connect on the left. Slightly curved line up, over, connect on the right. Come back on the left and let's just draw another curved line connect on the left and another curved line up, connect on the right. I come back to this space on the left and I draw a curve line out, slightly curve line in, curve line up, connect, and right about here I draw one, two slightly curved lines. I'm going to draw a curve line out, curve line up. I come on the right hand side and I'm going to draw a curve line out, slightly curve line, curve line in, connect. Let's put another little curved line and then slightly curved line one, two. In the center, I'm going to draw little curved lines all the way down, little straight lines on the left, little straight lines on the right. Okay. Now, right here, I'm going to draw a curved line up, come back down on the right, curved line up. We're going to draw a little curved line, little curved line connect, straight diagonal up, little curved line, straight diagonal down, connect, one, two, three little curved lines, little curved line on top. Now we're going to continue curved line, curved line down, jump over, don't draw through your drawing, curved line out, curved line out to the edge of your paper. Now come up here and we're just going to draw one, two straight lines, come up on the top, straight line, 
And now zigzag, zigzag, zigzag. Come down, straight line, straight line, straight line. Come inside, zigzag, 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 zigzag. Now I'm gonna just draw some curve lines, curve lines, curve lines. All right, this is a fireman, but we can also have fire women because women can do this job also. And if we just want to say both together, it is a fire person. Okay, I'm going to add a dotted line border all the way around the edge just to finish it off. Jump over, don't jump, don't draw through your drawing. And let's see, I think we're ready to color. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to color in is using all my yellow. So I'm going to put my badge up here and these two stripes yellow. I'm going to add a little bit of yellow up, down, up, down, zigzag right there. And then I'm going to color my whole entire suit yellow. Now, nowadays, fire people, police, a lot of people wear fluorescent colors so that they can be seen in these dangerous situations. So he's got yellow on all the way down and over. Okay, then I have my multicultural crayons. I'm going to color in my face. You'll do a better job than me. Here's my, my neck. Don't forget your neck. These are my hands. Okay. And I'm giving him orange hair. So this is all orange. A little bit of orange on his mustache. Okay. And then I'm going to do the bottom of his boots red orange. I'm going to do his stripes red orange. And I'm going to add some black for the inside of my space right here and the inside of this space right here and the top part of my space right here. This is all black. This is black. And, whoops, I forgot, red-orange for my helmet up here. Nowadays, they really want those colors to pop. So we'll do red-orange on this. Let's add a little bit of red to my, this is my burning building, my fire. Okay. And then my equipment, so my nozzle, my big hose, all of this will be gray. Now if you can think of a different color to make everything, go for it. This is just what I use. And I'm going to add some gray for smoke up here. Whoops, one more thing. You gotta have some water. Turquoise blue. Okay, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here is my fireman all colored in. Remember, a community helper is a person in your community that helps others. And this 
fireman is trying to keep us all safe. Okay, bye-bye.